If you steal your friend's food when they're not looking like I do, then subscribe and turn on those YouTube notifications. Let go! Oh no! <laughs> Look at the baby! Man, okay, this just ain't right, man. Ah uh, yes, the old fake baby in a skylight prank. Yep, oldest trick in the book. That's just scary, man. If you're using the toilet and then you look up and you see a baby right there, oh heck no. Nice of them to use all the blue tape just to tape a dang baby to the to the skylight. You guys already know it's some some white people stuff. Like, see, come on, you know black people would not do something like this, all right? They wouldn't even want to raise a baby. No, no, I'm just kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Man, all the stereotypes and racism, you better get that out of here. Woo, but this is it. This is 13 funny pranks and magic tricks and stuff that white people do. Anyway, anyway, we're not gonna talk about that. But comment down below your favorite prank. My favorite prank is telling people that they're adopted, but one time somebody said that I was adopted and I found out that it was true. <laughs> But if you guys think that this prank is pretty good, then drop a like and help me feel better about myself. And you know, you know, it's gonna help the channel grow. This baby is looking like you drank all the breast milk. I didn't, by the way, okay? Okay, I did. Anyway, moving on, we got step one, get giant beach balls. That sounds wrong, but yeah. Step two, paint eyes on them. Step three, place in tree facing neighbor's house. Step four, oh! <laughs> okay, that's creepy, man. What if the neighbors have been smoking marijuana? You know, they're smoking stuff and then they thought that they thought the tree was real. Trees are real, but like they thought the tree actually had eyes. They would be freaking out more than a black man finding out KFC's clothes. And why is this tree's eyes so close together? I mean, come on now. Hey, your tree, where's your nose? You could borrow some of my nose because mine's so big and people make fun of it all the time. So, you know, um. <laughs> okay, next one, we got. What? Oh! No! The dog! <laughs> That's so mean! That magic trick though, okay. Look at the face on the dog! The dog thinks its owner abandoned it! That's just sad, man. This dog is like. Where, where, where'd he go? Where, where'd he go? I've never seen a dog this confused before in my life. Like, man. And you see the Asian man in the back just like, ha ha ha, this is what I do for fun. Man, I'm about to call animal services. That, that's mean, jeez. I mean, I know it's like you're kind of playing a game with the dog. It's fine, it's fine. But look at the flick of the confusion on the dog. It's like, what, 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 where'd he go? What, what, huh? <laughs> the dog's so, he's so lost, he or she is so lost, and man, that's a shame. I bet you made this dog relive a painful memory of when its former owner abandoned it. Mm-hmm. You feel good about yourself, Asian man? You feel good? Uh, he probably does feel good, because that's, that's kind of funny. Made for a funny video, so yeah. Another one. Don't lift unless you're ready to kill it. <gasps> oh, that's cruel. That's a cruel prank. Okay, that could actually be a spider under there, or like some creepy, nasty bug. Or it could just be nothing under there. You don't know. And I'm not brave enough to find out. Not today. Uh-huh, nice try. You're not gonna have me getting bit by a dang black widow. That sounds racist. Black widow. Where, where's the white widow? Mm-hmm. Equality. Equal pay and equal rights and equal, uh, uh, equal, uh, uh, opportunity. Yeah. Vote for me. Leave on your colleague's desk on April Fool's Day and watch the fun. And of course, it's empty. Okay, so it is empty. Ha ha ha. It'd be funnier if you actually put like a tarantula up in there. And time out. Who has a yellow solo cup? I mean, come on. It's always the red cup. It's ridiculous, man. We got it. Pop- <laughs> Wait. Time out. Time out. What is Shia LaBeouf doing up in here serving Papa John's? Do it! Okay, so what? You put a fake cardboard cutout printout in front of somebody's peephole and they think they're getting free pizza. These are some mean pranks. If I went, looked at my peephole and I'm like, ooh, pizza guy, okay, cool. And then you open up the door and ain't nobody there. Nobody there, I can relate growing up. <sighs> anyway, and why does this pizza delivery guy have the creepiest smile? I mean, he looks like he just murdered somebody and made them into a pizza. But this could be the best Tinder profile pick. If you got pizza, all the girls gonna be hitting you up. You guys know girls go crazy for pizza. I mean, sometimes it has to be vegan pizza. Ew. But you know, you know, it's, it's fine. I mean, look, I mean, vegan pizza is, is great. It's good. Tastes good. Yeah, yeah, vegan.
No. Let's keep it going. We got, okay, you got, oh, a dollar in the book. Oh, why? That's cruel. That's mean, man. All these pranks are mean, man. Like, seriously, look at, geez. You go to the library, you check out a book, and you're like, oh, there's a dollar in it. And then you feel like you're getting rewarded for reading and trying to get a higher education, but then you pull the dollar out and nothing. And you just get pranked, like, a, with, a, with a dank meme face. Like, come on. That's a problem. Yes, there's a problem. I only got like a little snippet of a dollar. I cannot get me something off the McDonald's dollar menu with this. Trying to get me a McFlurry and a, and a small fry and two apple pies and, and a large, well, I can't get a large because that costs more than a dollar. Gosh dang, man. DJ Khaled, another, another one. one. Oh! That looks like one of the orcs from Lord of the Rings. What the heck? Dang, is that Shrek's cousin? Man, if somebody has to really use the bathroom and then they walk in here, lift the toilet seat up and see that, man. They're either gonna get so scared that they don't have to go to the bathroom anymore or they're gonna get so scared that they don't have to go to the bathroom anymore <laughs> because they either pooped their pants or they got so scared that they sucked it back up and you know, it, it was nasty, it was nasty. Oh, oh, disgusting. These are some cruel and unusual pranks. Like guys, please don't don't do that to me. I would be terrified if somebody did that to a toilet that they knew I was about to use. Oh no. Hey, why are you so blue? <laughs> uh, that's their skin color. They're, they're actually blue. I mean, that, that is blue, right? Yeah, yeah, it's blue, it's blue. Next one, we got, okay, a little cutout cut. Oh, ooh, that's scary. Oh, it's the girl from the grudge. Or it looks like the girl from the grudge. You just print out a head, print out a hand on paper, cut it out, and then tape it to the shower curtain. Oh, why is everybody trying to scare everybody? up in the bathroom jeez bathrooms are meant for peace and tranquility and simplicity in the bathroom I don't know about you guys but I need to focus okay sometimes it's a tough time in there but then you go and you try to you just want to take a shower and you see that thing oh if I saw that I think it was like an ex-girlfriend trying to get back together mm -mm. yes I dated girls that look like that all right don't judge me that's scary man ain't nobody got time for that <laughs> What? Dang! Just turned into Jurassic World. What? That thing looks scary. You're just walking outside, going to the mailbox to see if you, you know, got a check or if you got an Amazon package and you see that thing? I'm the person that would really fall for that and like I'd open the mailbox and I would think it's real. Even though dinosaurs are extinct, I'd still think that was real. I'd be like, dang, what kind of dog is that? But everybody, every living thing is beautiful in its own way, except that thing. That thing is ugly. Not trying to be mean, but you know, that thing, ooh, ugh, jeez. It looks like a dinosaur had a baby with a flower. Like, 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 what the heck? Ew. Y'all better not put that in my mailbox. Don't do it, man. It's scary. <gasps> Jeez, why is everybody trying to scare me? <laughs> my roommate thought this would be funny for me to wake up and see. I'm sure once I change my shorts, I'll see the humor in it. <laughs> no, even after I change my shorts, I still ain't gonna see the humor in that. Like, they put Slender Man at the end of the hall. Oh, heck no. Dang, this cutout thing looks malnourished. It looks like it needs to eat a sandwich real quick. And why does it have to be black? Oh, yeah, so they just assume all the black people break into houses and stand creepily at the end of hallways. Uh-huh. Uh, some things ain't never changed. They could have put a white cutout over there, and okay, it probably wouldn't have been as scary, but still. It's racism up in here, and we ain't gonna t tolerate it. Okay, we're gonna tolerate it, but after this video, we're not gonna tolerate it. Man putting creepy cutouts at the end of hallways, boy, you better get that out of here. Moving on, what, what? A another, another peephole cutout trick? Mm-hmm, that's kind of scary. I mean, you got like, dang, officers up in here. The other one was fine with the delivery man, but this one, you got like some officer? Mm -hmm. no. Best believe I ain't opening that door, sorry. Mm -mm. I ain't letting the police see me and then be like, you look like you fit a description. Why don't you come with me to the, down to the precinct and we'll get you booked and locked up by lunch. No. Do people still do these pranks? Like, like seriously, geez. Why does the dude on the left look so angry? He looks like he did not save 15% or more on his car insurance. You could have saved hundreds, man, if you had switched earlier, but for shame, man, you, d you thought you'd go to Mercury. <laughs> I I I'm with Mercury. Um, insurance, so yeah. Shout out to Mercury. It's ridiculous, man. G ah! Ah, whoa! 
all these Lord of the Rings creature. I mean, you got Gollum in your side view mirror. That's dangerous though, because somebody could be driving and then they see that and then they freak out and then they drive off a cliff. I'm not saying Gollum's ugly, but Gollum ain't the most beautiful thing I've, you know, you've seen. So yeah, it's kind of creepy. I'm usually pretty calm when I'm driving, but like, you know, seeing that in the in the side view mirror, man, that's almost worse than having a bumblebee fly through your window while you're driving. And then you gotta like find a way to whack it out. Okay, last one we got, ah, Pennywise, no. People just in the office trying to do their job and then they go looking for a stapler and then they see Pennywise. That ain't right, man, that, that, this is scary. All these cutouts, we gotta take away the printers from these guys, this is getting ridiculous. Hey Pennywise, why are your eyebrows so thin? Dang man, you gotta thicken those things up. Those look like two anorexic caterpillars above your eyes. Roasting. That's a shame, man. We're out here roasting Pennywise the clown. Mm-hmm. But then again, I mean, he deserves it, right? Yeah, yeah, he does. Oh, and Pennywise, your head is shaped like a light bulb. <laughs> Woo, man, that's it for 13 funny pranks and magic tricks. Thank you guys for watching the videos. Be sure to comment down below which one of the pranks was your favorite. I like the dog magic trick one. That one was pretty messed up. It was funny, it was funny. Okay, and of course, I like the baby one in the skylight. I like that one, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure to get some of the new Dang Matt Smith merch. We got phone cases, hoodies, shirts. The Just Blame Jamal shirts just came out, so click the first link in the description below. Woo, and yeah, that's it. Hit me up on Instagram and Twitter at Dang Matt Smith, and I'm gonna see you guys next time. Peace.